On the fifth Sunday of Lent, the Orthodox Church commemorates our Righteous Mother Mary of Egypt. The feast day of St. Mary of Egypt is April 1st, the day of her repose. However, she is also commemorated on the Sunday due to her recognition by the Church as a model of repentance. As a Sunday of Great Lent, the commemoration is celebrated with the Divine Liturgy of St. Basil the Great, which is preceded by a Matin service. A Great Vespers is conducted on Saturday evening. Scripture readings for the fifth Sunday of Lent are the following. At the Orthros, the prescribed weekly gospel reading. At the Divine Liturgy, Hebrews chapter 9, verse 11 to 14. Mark chapter 10, verse 32 to 45. St. Mary of Egypt is also commemorated on the Thursday before the fifth Sunday of Lent, when her life is read during the great canon of St. Andrew of Crete. A canon in her honor is read at the end of each ode. In parish churches, the service and the canon is most often conducted on Wednesday evening. But why does the church find this story so important? Why does the whole Orthodox world remember this woman? The story of St. Mary is the story of a repentant harlot. Her life tells us about how from her early youth she carried on an extremely debauched life and then more like a tourist than a pilgrim decided to go to Jerusalem for the feast of the exaltation of the honorable cross of the Lord. But a mysterious power would not let her enter the church until she became conscious of her sins and called out to the Mother of God and to the Lord for mercy. Then she was able to enter the church and shake into the core resolved to spend the rest of her life in prayer and repentance. Many years later, the saintly monk Zosimas met her in the desert. It is from him that we know her story.